Okay, so in this video, I'm going to show you how to integrate your Instagram onto your Show It website using Snap Widget and an embedded code onto your Show It website. Super simple. So what we're going to do is, and this is just, I'm starting off of the Goddess Girl website template that is in my Bold and Boho shop if you are in need of a website that's easy to use and fully customizable and already all built out for you. Make sure to go check out the shop. But what we're gonna do is come down here and we already have this embed code in here. If you're starting from scratch and you don't have a template, all you'll wanna do is use this embed code here down on the bottom. So you'll see that it's spread out pretty wide. What I'm going to do is go to Snap Widget and I've already logged in to my username and used the free grid. So now what I'm going to do is make this one and this probably, oops, the other way, um, seven and one. So it shows my feed like that. Now I'm gonna change this to zero padding and no hover, no sharing buttons, and change it to responsive. Then I'll get that widget. I'll copy it to clipboard and I'll come back to show it and drop it into the embed box. Save that. Now you'll see it pop up. And when I just go back to home and preview that page, you can see what it looks like automatically. So if I go down to the bottom, you'll see that this stuff is cut off. Sometimes it will even be too small. And what you'll want to do is just play around with the size. Sometimes you'll need to show less boxes depending on your um, how many you want to show. But what I will do is I will actually cut it off from this post to this post. So what I need to do is just keep bringing it actually larger like that and then centering it. And that way it will actually show those two extra images when you are on a bigger monitor. So it doesn't automatically um, resize which is really unfortunate, but we can make it work by doing this. So you'll notice when I was just on the homepage, I still have a little bit more to go. So I'm just going to keep dragging it a little bit more like that. Just previewing it. And I'm so close. <laughs> and I'm just going to go back one more time, make it a little bit bigger like that. Now drag up that excess bottom, preview it, and there we go. It should be a perfect fit. And then that way also when I'm on a monitor, it fully goes across the whole page with no excess side panel showing. So that is how you add an Instagram widget from Snap Widget onto your Show It site. If you've enjoyed this video or learned anything, make sure to subscribe and like and comment anything else that you want to learn from me about show it or web design or anything branding because that's my shit. Okay. Much love you guys.